I have a, a really nice map of the world and I'm going to put it up in my room and make a video with it. And then I'm going to put uh, pens of all the places that I've gone to in my map of the world on my wall. But before I can do that, I got to visit the, the top two corners of, of my map and put uh, pens there to, to hold up the map. And sometimes, you know, if we uh, don't have a good foundation, then it gets knocked down. So you got to do things methodically in the right way. And the best thing to do at this point is we need to, to realize that uh, unity of all people is what is needed in this world uh, because otherwise we're all going to fall down. And unity brings forth the end of enemies. And it is possible by the understandings that uh, God is bringing forth at this hour. And this hour, he has brought forth his love, the love, his law of love. And he says unto all people beloved of him, I'm your God, you're my people, I forgive you and I will never remember it. You see, the second that we enter into glory, we are as sinless as the day that we were born. And it, it, Jesus said, all sin is forgiven except the unforgivable sin if we cast Christ right out of our hearts. And, you know, the whole world has been teaching error for, for thousands of years, especially in regard to Christianity. Um, the church went and uh, defined how to become born again by believing when Jesus says the opposite. Uh, many, he says many are going to say, Lord, I did this, I did this, I believed. And he's going to say, sorry, Charlie, it's never been about belief. You let your love life go out. Uh, so put... Uh, Put a star in your pocket as a reminder that your heart should be fervent and passionate. If you're just lukewarm about love, you don't have it. And so it's time to realize that uh, if you have conditions on the love of everyone around you, you are absolutely loveless because conditional love is not love at all. Um, so we need to um, be at liberty and we need freedom and the freedom and the liberty that we can give unto others. You know, many of, of you watching me, you need to let go of someone. And if you let them go and they come back to you, then they are yours. If not, they never were. And you're just kidding yourself. Maybe you kept them around because they were a conditional, uh, convenient person to have in your life, but you really never cared or you don't really love them. Love is a choice. Uh, no one can ever get married and have a successful marriage if they do not have unconditional love. So love from love and hope from hope and peace from our Prince of Peace. Welcome to the age of the glory of the Lord being poured out upon all flesh. All flesh that will be like Dusty there. Dusty seven, the triple seven, 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 the mark of the Lamb. Revelation 9, 4, indelibly stamped on all people who will keep their love alive as a child. And under, uh, uh, under that banister of love uh, against such, there is no law and there is no victory of any mark of the beast over people like that. And so it's time to, to really get excited about what love is wanting to do in this hour. So until next time, come on back now, yeah. yeah, yeah.